Hey guys, so I'm in Chicago, Illinois, and this is Lincoln Park. And look at the beautiful flowers in the garden up here. And I'm about to go into the Lincoln Park Conservatory to see hopefully some really cool plants. So let's go inside and check it out. Okay, so here's, wow, a palm house, water lilies and fish in here, oh, koi, water lotus, too bad it's not in flower, I see a, a spent flower, the seed pod, oh, and you see that thing, red thing, it's like a, I think a heliconia or something like that hanging there. Look at the philodendron. You're right. What's this? It's called a sausage tree. This big thing hanging down. There must be like almost two feet long on this big tree. And so here's the tag for it. Look at the Silver Sparkles Red Stem Pilea, Pilea Glauca. I think this is a common house plant. Look at how it's grown over this wall onto the walkway. Awesome. This is a fox tail palm. It's super tall. And right next to it, um, it's bamboo. It's called the painted bamboo because you can see the yellow and the green lines through it. So here's the Calathea mosaica. There's a huge section of this. And so the sign says it's a spirit Calathea, so I guess that's another name for it. And also, um, Espirito Santo, maybe that's the Brazilian name. But yeah, look at the pattern on the leaves. Very beautiful. Just a random Hoya Cariae hanging in a basket up here besides all the palms. This one's supposed to have a really cool flower, white bat flower, but I don't see any inflorescence. Look at that root on that tree. Let's see, it's a screw pine, it says. This is a tail flower, which is an anthurium. And look how gigantic these leaves are. So here's my hand as a reference. Amazing. And look at it, it looks like there's flowers. They don't look so great, but it looks like they're, they bloomed a while ago and now they're fade, faded. Oh, 
more Calatheas. Creeping Charlie. Ooh, look at this philodendron. Philodendron gloriosum. I really want one of these big philodendrons, but they're so expensive. Look at this leather plant. It has bumps on the trunk. And the leaves are cool, kind of cool looking. Okay, so this is the Grand Leaf Philodendron. It's wrapped around this metal uh, pillar. And look at the trunk. And then the leaves. This leaf has to be almost four foot long. It's amazing. I don't know if I can get it. How ginormous it is. It's backlit, so. Bad view, but it's so beautiful. It's the Rex Begonia vine cis discolor. So I have this in my garden, but my leaves are definitely not this big. So if anyone knows how to grow leaves this big, let me know. Mine are like, probably like, the biggest ones are probably like this size, you know? But look at this. And there's like, um, maybe it's hard to see on the camera, but it's like a purple tinge. And the younger leaves, it shows a lot more. Look at this, it's like bright purple. And then, of course, the other side is very dark. And look, at, it's grown all the way up. This huge mass of nerve plant, Petonia albivenis, looking good. Not wilted, so they must keep it very well watered. These things hanging down here are from a candle tree. And it's big, it's right there. Look at these. I guess this must be a philodendron. No. Wait, yes. I don't see a sign though, but this one's a elephant ear. Alocasia on this side. Wenti eye. Some more calatheas. And more nerve plants. Here's another room. And look at how amazing it looks. There's ferns everywhere. Oh, it's the fern room. And look how lush this maiden fern is. I can't, it's really difficult for me to keep maiden hair ferns. I love the moss growing on the rocks. Look at the maiden hair fern just grows out of the crevices of the rocks. Cotton candy fern. Fringed bird nest fern. This is a cardboard palm. The leaves are very like thick and papery, like cardboard and stiff. Look at all that maiden hair fern. Wow, look at this rabbit's foot it's fern. I've never seen one this big for you before. Gavalia. And it's like on a, growing on a pole. This is probably like eight feet tall. 
Maybe taller. Wow. Oh, look at there's turtles in this pond. You see on the left side. Guys swimming. Orchid house. Let's take a look. Wow. Look at that huge catlea looking flower. Or not flower, plant. I'm not sure what's vining on this wall. It looks like vanilla. But look at it's reached. That's like, I don't know, a two story building. And the leaves are so thick. Oh yeah, it is vanilla. Let's see, it's on the sign. I can't focus on it. There we go. Look at this vanilla. No flowers though. Dendrobiums some bromeliads with it. Miltoniopsis. Oh, a Neophanetia. Or actually, no, this is a hybrid. Ascophanetia peaches. This is Stanhopea. I need to plant this in a basket because the bloom stalks grow from the bottom. And too bad we're not going to see it bloom, but it looks like there's three big buds. All these hummingbirds. This looks like the ruby rubber plant. This one's called the black gold philodendron. These are very dark and It's climbing on the trunk of another tree. Hey, I think this plant is popular on Instagram, Calathea. But I think it's called the Orbifolia on the line. Maybe this one's slightly different. Something's been drumming flowers. 